This video that you're about to watch, this hello folks, this video that you're about to watch is uh, just an example of what we have been doing on a weekly basis in terms of our faith meetings here at St. Emily School. Uh, every Thursday morning at 9.45, we gather as a community and uh, our faith mentor, Andrea Boris, will lead us in a reflection. Uh, we will say our intentions and have a prayer time together. I can certainly tell you from my personal standpoint that it is one of the highlights of the week and something that I always look forward to. And so that's what this recording that you're about to watch consists of. Okay. Um, thanks everybody for coming. And uh, I know that this week on the news, it's been another challenge to kind of watch. Um, I know I've been struggling with uh, the an, another kind of bad news that we're, we're seeing and um, all the people are fighting for um, just equal rights and the injustices going on. So not only the pandemic that we're worrying about and now we're seeing just our neighbors struggling and even here in Canada, um, struggling for, for rights, equal rights and all that. So um, I know the, the Pope has been in touch. I was reading the Pope is in touch with the Bishop, um, the, the Bishop in the U S and just trying to find some kind of just saying support he's supporting, um, all, everyone's fight for, for equal rights. So I had a prayer that I found just, um, in that vein, just reminding us how we're, we're all made in God's image and, um, we're, we're all the same. So if we can keep all of our intentions in our hearts and just really be thinking of everyone who, who's fighting that fight and um, how we can be part of that solution as well. So here's, a, here's the prayer that, that I found. In the name of the Father, Son, Holy Spirit. Amen. God of justice, in your wisdom, you create all people in your image without exception. Through your goodness, open our eyes to see the dignity, beauty, and worth of every human being. Open our minds to understand that all your children are brothers and sisters in the same human family. Open our hearts to repent our attitudes, behaviors, and speech, which demean others. Open our ears to hear the cries of those wounded by discrimination and their passionate appeals for change. Strengthen our resolve to make amends for past injustices and to right the wrongs of history. Fill us with the courage that we might seek to heal wounds, build bridges, forgive, and be forgiven, and establish peace and equality for all in our communities. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. And if we want to say, um, and our Father as well, our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be thy done, will be done. On, on earth, earth as it is, is in heaven. Give us this day, us this day, our, day our daily bread, daily bread. And, and forgive us our trespasses, trespasses as we forgive those, forgive those who trespass against us. us. And, and lead us not into temptation, temptation, but deliver, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Amen. And so that gives you an idea of what our adult faith meetings that uh, we have every week at St. Emily's looks like. Uh, while you couldn't tell from the recording, there's actually a group generally of about eight to ten of us in terms of staff members who come together and really with the intention of just wanting to lift up our community. We recognize that there are so many needs within our community, within our school board, within our world, and just wanting to really make sure that we're, we're regularly connecting with God and, and calling on him to serve as that leader for us. Uh, we hope uh, that uh, this model that uh, we have shared with you may jog your memory and create and get your creative juices going and and if in some way we can encourage you to develop a, a similar uh small faith group uh, we would certainly love to see that and hear about it
Thank you very much.